Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And today we're playing Celebrity Alcohol Deathmatch. Celebrities love their own brand alcohols, right? It's the new badge of honor. You just have to have your own tequila <laughs> no. brand. We've got gin, we've got whiskey, we've got vodka, we've got tequila. Wow. With all that alcohol. I think we're the only ones <laughs> risking death. <laughs> we're the ones. Drink who responsibly. Are in trouble. <laughs> we're doing this so you don't have to. <laughs> We've met Ryan Reynolds. He has one of the most famous celebrity endorsed alcohols. Aviation American gin. But you know who also has the celebrity endorsed gin? <laughs> No. Her Royal Maj Highness, the Queen of England. Oh, okay. Buckingham Palace small batch dry gin. I didn't know that existed. Hand-picked botanicals from cool. Buckingham Palace's exceptional garden have been combined to create this unique and flavorsome gin. Are you serious? That's cool. I know. Ryan Reynolds versus the Queen. I mean, that's a cage fight I want to see. We're starting high. <laughs> We're starting at a flipping top what level do you cage do match. as Ryan Reynolds oh in, that, in that situation? I suppose you I just mean... break the fourth wall, make a funny quip, and then yeah. let her knock you out. Like, that's the only <laughs> option. One of these is Ryan Reynolds. Okay. One of them is the Q-Dog Supreme. That smells, that smells botanical. Very botanical. That smells a bit aviate. Like, like gasoline. <laughs> like gasoline. Gasoline. <laughs> 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 All right, let's try A first. Cheers. Chin chin. <sighs> that is neat gin. <laughs> I don't know whether I've ever had neat gin before. Oh, okay. I have. <laughs> I have. Oh. oh. <laughs> yeah. Have you been uh, hanging out with other people? No, no, me and Gabby love a bit of neat gin. Oh, okay. <laughs> really? Really? Some gins, yeah. yeah. Some gins are really nice. Oh, neat. I see. Some Fancy gins. gins. Yeah. yeah. The ones that I don't. <laughs> the Queen's gin. Okay, the you Queen's think that's. Quite, that's quite nice neat. That is actually nice neat. Some are terrible neat. I could drink that. It does. Even just on the rocks by it, itself. It also has a gasoline flavour to no, it. it. It's a doesn't. little bit. That's a just little the bit. All right, All right, B. B. Cheers. Okay, A Ooh. is fruitier, right? More flowery. <laughs> it feels like it's come from Buckingham Gin. Palace Garden. I think B tastes like it belongs in like an aircraft hangar with a bomber jacket. In a glass with some ice and tonic water. Yeah, not, not... with The Rock and Gal Gadot, no, who have yeah. literally no screen chemistry. <laughs> wow! A must be the Queen's, right? A is definitely nice. A is the winner, yeah. They're both very good though. Tell us. A. Yeah. Knew it. Well done, okay, Queenie. Well, commiserations to Ryan Reynolds. I think you can walk out with your head held high. Unfortunately, your head will have to be held high by paramedics. <laughs> uh, because the Queen delivered a savage knockout blow. Queen wins the gin round. Next up, Josh, we're moving on to whiskey. Lagavulin 11? Nick Offerman. That's cool. So from the sublime to the ridiculous, <laughs> this is Virginia Black. Who's that? Drake. Oh. Wow, he hasn't like put his branding all over. To be honest, it, it honestly cool. looks like they just hollowed out a Grammy and filled it with whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> you know? It's an interesting comparison because it's obviously Very an Isle whiskey versus yeah. a bourbon. Well, maybe it's gonna be able to tell. I'll just, from smelling it, instantly be able to tell you. Okay, don't tell me, don't tell I me. I mean, you, yeah, you'll, you'll know, you'll know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know what though, it smells like, it smells like Drake's music. Yeah, which is very popular. Very popular, mainstream. Yeah, very hard to do. Very consumable. It's almost maple syrupy in how yeah. sweet it is. Let's try number two. Immediately smell sort of like a proper wood camping fire. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Just infinitely more depth. Okay, so... So much flavor. Okay. It's not really a fair fight, you know? They don't compete. They've been training in different combat Look, techniques. they're both calling themselves whiskey. I'm sorry, they're in the same category here. Okay. I will admit, we've, right. got, we've got heavyweight versus like a, what do they call it? Like... Fel felter weight? Felter weight. Me melter. <laughs> melting, melting all of the weight melted off. But... It's garden gnome versus transformer. No, I, I, I would say... Gnome gets crushed. No. Gets All right, well, look, we both have a vote. So who are you voting for? Also, though, we're, like, we're saying vote? this is blind, but we totally know. A, like, can we confirm? A is no, actually no, the No, no, no. Don't break the rules. 
What's your vote? Oh, okay. B. B is just better. All right. B I vote better. A, and it's a draw. What are you talking about? <laughs> Why? I'm on the side of Drake. Are you? I just Okay, I, I'll vote A too then. I vote B. You're an idiot. See? He's, he's already said he voted B. We'll edit that no, bit out. I vote A. I edit. <laughs> so he's been training for Thumb Wars, Bro. and he goes in against Nick Offerman, yes. who's been Let's training be, okay. Mai Tai. Oh, wait, is that look, a cocktail or listen, a combat sport? Oh, okay. <laughs> look, I like Drake. Yeah? yeah? I'm not saying that A is necessarily Drake's drink. Look, and he's he sacrificed one of his Grammys for this. <laughs> He's got like a couple of thousand Grammys. Wow. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, all right, uh, yeah, no, good, Nick Hoffman wins. Ron Swanson wins. It's a good drink. That's better. All right, you convinced me. Uh, should we confirm? Yeah, we don't, we don't, we don't need to confirm. Okay, next up we have. Let's go. I'm so ready for the next round. Vodka and born and bred craft potato vodka. Isn't all vodka from potatoes? Yeah. Okay. I did not know that. It's clarifying. This is Magic Mike himself. Oh. Channing Tatum. Channing Tatum has made a vodka. Yeah. And that is the artist formerly known yeah. as Puff Daddy. It's P, it's P. Oh. Diddy. It's interesting though, because there's P. Diddy, right? Are there any other P? Like P? Peas in the rap world? Because there's loads of Lil's, right? There's a lot of Lil's. There's loads of Lil's. There's like a confusing amount of Lil's. Yeah. You wouldn't think in the rap world, calling yourself Lil or something would yeah. be a term of respect. Well, it's 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 understatement, right? Well, you Lil idiot. Sounds like an insult. Yeah, maybe. That was a nice little discussion. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. Sidoc. It's distilled from fine French grapes. Oh, yeah. Wow. So it's not a potato. True innovation of French craftsmanship. I've got no idea about vodka. Vodka, I feel like I should drink this in a shot. Let's start with A. Shot it. Yeah, well, I'm gonna have a little, a little A little sip. shot, okay. A little sip. Half shot. Okay. That's wow. pretty smooth. It's kind of fruity. Yeah. Kind of reminds me of soju in a way. Yeah. B, man, this that's gonna take some beating. All right, less smooth. <laughs> I don't know whether I'm just reading into it. Yeah. But that tastes earthy, like a potato. It does. <laughs> that tastes like it's been made from potatoes. It does, right? Genuine. It tastes, you know when you go to like Whole Foods and something, the potatoes still have mud on to mm. prove they've mm. actually been grown. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Yeah. I think they made that from potatoes still with mud yeah. on. Oh, can you, can you leave farming. the mud on? A bit farming. For Channing? Yeah. He's super specific <laughs> about his potatoes. In my mind, this is pretty clear. A takes it. What was A? A yeah, Siroc. Next round. Let's All go. Right. I'm excited about this round. We have. Oh dear. <laughs> I know where this is going. <laughs> Tequila. Tequila. Rock. Dwayne The Rock Johnson and Kendall Jenner. Okay, Kendall. The Rock versus Kendall Jenner. That's a fight I'd pay to see. Let's give these a scent, shall we? Okay. Oh man, I forgot what tequila smells like for a second. <laughs> Holy moly. We're we gonna do this with a chaser? This is intense, yeah, 100%. You've got like crystal eye. <laughs> <laughs> Massive salt crystals. Okay, ready? Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I've still got so much salt in my mouth. I, I just pale. wanna taste it. Yeah, we don't need to do that. We're not doing shots. I'm just sipping. We're just sipping. <laughs> it's strong on its own though. <laughs> it's way more smooth than I remember yeah. tequila being. I remember te like a shot of tequila being just a nightmare that you have to get through for social occasions in that, university. But it's quite nice. Mm. B, I it. don't I don't have a clue who's that one. I've got no idea. Ooh, nice. ooh. Aftertaste. No, you're right, the aftertaste is actually not bad. The foretaste in that is better. So much better. But once you get into conversation with this guy, it's so much deeper. Mm. I feel like that's the rock. I don't know why. This one's like vanilla yes. It's like vanilla -y. It is vanilla -y. I prefer A. I'm just gonna call it. I think I prefer A too. A wins. Um, this is the first time I'm completely clueless. Yeah. A is Kendall Gunner. Wow. That hey. is a huge upset. <laughs> 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 we 
love you, Rock, but I'm afraid you just got knocked out by Kendall Jenner. We are on to the final round. We have... What the heck's going on here? Sidemen vodka and Sainsbury's Basics vodka. Oh, <laughs> Sidemen. The Sidemen have a vodka. This, it's sold out in minutes. They definitely pitched this as a premium vodka. Yeah. Like the way all of the ads and stuff yeah. is like... This is this is like proper premium, and they know what they're doing. These guys, That's they're true. not stupid. That's true. It's really savvy really hard to get where where they've got. Clearly to. savvy. But also the other thing we're drinking is is fripping Sainsbury's vodka. Hopefully it will be really obvious. All right. Let's A. Go. A first. Oh wow, the smell. Okay, I feel like I've got no frame, oh! no frame of reference. That's a lot worse than either that of the vodkas we tried. tastes like the vodka tried. of our student days. Yeah, it just no. smells like like surface cleaner. Oh. Next up. Okay. Oh. Oh. Wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. The smell is much I'm, better. The I'm smell is much better. <laughs> I'm confused now. I'm really <laughs> confused and I'm nervous. I don't want a KSI diss track. That's true. <laughs> they taste, they smell exactly the same to me. Mm -mm. Exactly the mm -mm. same. Literally, you go like this. <laughs> oh, you're breaking your, how are you even doing that? They smell so bad. Like <laughs> intense. <laughs> oh. They are remarkably similar. Remarkably similar. <laughs> B is disgusting. <laughs> B is absolutely revolting. I just spat that. It smells better. It wait, smells wait, wait, wait. better. It, B smells better. But A is a lot more drinkable. A is smooth by comparison. You know what happens? <laughs> you know what? You know, there's, you know the rare occasion in a fight yeah. where both fighters just throw a huge freaking punch at the same time. Sort of like Matrix style. Boom, boom, okay. boom, boom, bang. Double knockout. It's a Logan Paul KSI draw. They, that's it. <laughs> They both lose. No, I no, I I think you I need, need to I think A wins. I I agree. Maybe B smells a little bit better. They're not selling a smell product, right? They're selling a drink. It's true. But and so which is impacts which taste. is easier to drink, A? You think? I think so. Okay, which one was A? A is Sainsbury's. <laughs> Oh, that is a shocker. That is a shocker. Oh, that's <laughs> B does smell a lot better. It B, B does smell a lot better. It does. It does. It does. It does. It went in. Oh, that's awkward. <laughs> that was a big fight night. Big for Joe parts. Rogan's going to have a lot to talk about in the morning. <laughs> okay. Maybe the time is right for you and me oh, no. <laughs> to launch our own alcohol brand. We should make a vodka out of carrots. <laughs> we should do it. Is that even possible? I'll look into it. <laughs> oh no. All right, that has been Celebrity Alcohol Death Match. Thank you to all oh. of the celebrities who participated. Commiserations <laughs> to those who lost. Maybe um, we'll uh, pit the winners against each other at some point. Yeah, but, uh, maybe in private. We've had enough to drink for tonight, so I think we'll call that here. In the meantime, <laughs> we'll see you jolly soon. See you later.